What is going on today, YouTube? I'm back. I hope everybody's having a good day today. Today is Sunday. Uh, we got a nice little install for the Cummins today. We're going to be doing uh, some rock lights. All right. So I've had these. I've had these for a while inside of the garage, and I've just never gotten the time and gotten around to doing them. Uh, so now I have the time. I'm going to get it done. It shouldn't take that long. Um, fairly simple, uh, you know job so I'm gonna go over here and show y'all what we're working with and then we will go from there yo so this is it um this is no means that I don't think this is a name brand one this is 50 bucks on eBay 50 bucks on eBay comes with the controller all four all four of the rock light you know little fellas um I might have to run up to Walmart to get some electric tape because I don't have any uh but other than that, we should be good. And I might have to pick up some self-tapping screws. So I'm going to open this up. And I'm going to kind of lay out how I want to do it for the truck. And then, and this is the slide box. I mean, it comes in these colors, you know, red, blue, yellow. I'm probably going to be rocking blue and red. Uh, maybe green, once in a while for board. Mostly blue. And yeah, this is it. Hey, real quick, while I had the chance, one, I'm sorry if it's windy out here because it's kind of windy. Two, I want to thank everybody who's been subscribing, checking out the channel, following everything, keeping up on the Instagram and whatnot. Uh, I really appreciate you guys. Be, uh, for those of you that are new to the channel, just subscribing recently, I want to thank you. I'm looking at my dog. He's taking a crap. <laughs> Uh, if, for those of you that are new to the channel, I want to thank you for subscribing. Uh, I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the family. Uh, you guys are awesome. So thank you once again for checking out my channel, checking out what I'm doing, okay? But no further, we're going to go ahead and get this started, all right? One second. Yo, yo. Okay, so I'm back. I started doing a little bit of uh, removing some panels, the two front splash guards for the truck. Uh, yeah, I just took them out. I'm going to show you guys what it is. Only reason why I'm doing this in the garage right now, like talking in the garage, is because it's really windy outside, and I don't want uh, you guys to just be hearing a bunch of wind noise and stuff, because I think that's pretty crappy on videos, okay? So I'm going to show you guys what I got to so far, and you know, let you know uh, what I'm doing and what my plan is. Alright, y'all. So we got this one here, and this one here. This is from the front, too. Uh, the wheel guards. Uh, I took them out, because I'm going to drill the rock light mounts into them all those wires and stuff is for my train horn don't worry about it I actually I'm gonna be fixing that today too so that's a little surprise surprise if you're watching this you hear the train horn as long as it still works all right so I lay out everything I like to lay stuff out before I do work um, this is the controller the four wires for each wheel well and then you got to run these to a, a power ground okay my batteries really is what I'm gonna do. Uh, I was just experimenting, you know, playing, looking at this stuff and whatnot. But this is it, so I'm gonna go ahead and get that drilled up in there and get it uh, set up. I haven't figured out where I'm gonna put the controller yet. One more thing I'm gonna have to do on my truck that's a little different is if you see these hub, these it's a plastic. Uh, one second. All right, so there's a plastic fucking liner in the truck I'm gonna take it out eventually so I care I give zero fucks about it um, pretty much I'm gonna have to cut a little hole out, like a little square hole out so I can see the inner inner fender of the bed because I'm going to drill two little holes through it but I can't get access to it because it's stupid covers in here so this this can be a project uh, looking forward to down the road freaking bed liner delete <laughs> all right you guys I will get back to you once I make some good progress okay okay I'm back you guys uh, real quick sorry for not putting you guys on the time-lapse for this uh, particular video it's just that uh, this isn't really a how-to install the rock lights this is more just like me doing it um, but I am gonna walk you guys you know through little sections that I'm doing um, real quick all I did right now was I went ahead and ran my run your lights first uh, run your lights get them in position run them to wherever the reason why I say run them first is because that way you know where to place the module, the controller box, because if you put it in the hood, you might not have enough room, especially if it's like a long truck like this, you might not have enough length on the cables for the lights themselves. So I'm gonna show you guys what I did. So real quick, I went in here, I found where I wanted to do it, I mounted it, and then what I did was, because I'm taking this bed liner out eventually, and I don't wanna have to 
mess with the wires again. All I did was I drilled the holes, ran the wire through, drilled another hole to the right of it, forward, you know, to the front of the truck, ran it back through because I'm gonna run, I'm gonna run this, I'm gonna run this down, uh, down the frame up to the front, up to the front. Um, I'm gonna get some, it's gonna look clean though. It's not gonna just be a wire hanging here. I'm gonna route it so that way it looks professional. Um, I'm starting to look and I wonder if this is supposed to be open like this or is there supposed to be a wheel well, a wheel well liner. Um, if you guys who have third gen Cummings, uh, mine is a 08. For those of you that know, um, let me know. Cause it, I don't know if it's just supposed to be metal or if it's supposed to be a plastic liner in there. So I think I may have shown you guys already what I've done here. Uh, went ahead and positioned the lights where I wanted them. Uh, I was reading somewhere, I don't remember where, but it was, it was saying if you want if you want to, to get the best light, uh, overall lighting effect, you want it to put it. You want to put it as close, as close to the fender as possible. So, for instance, this is the side, you know, fender, right? When you put it in, you don't want the light back there. You want it like kind of like up, up in here. So that's what we were going for. Um, I'm, I'm really, I'm anxious to see how it looks. Uh, it's so, yeah, definitely. But uh, everything's going good. I just want to show you guys what's up and what is going on. All right. I'm going to start running these wires forward and then I will get back to you guys and show you how it's All right, what is up? I'm back again. So real quick, we ran all of everything is done. It's all good. Uh, rock lights are in. It looks clean and professional. Uh, it, I'm not going to lie. It was a pain in the ass. Check that out. This uh, looks a little ghetto right now, but once I take out the bed liner, I'm gonna rerun it. But for now, that's going to do, okay? Um, yeah, if you guys hear that sound. Got that fucking, got that air tank charging up for my train horn. Hopefully it, uh, it sounds off. But yeah, all I got left to do, I got a positive and a negative coming from the controller. I'm just gonna connect them each to one side and then that is it. Um, also, I'm about to start downloading, downloading the app, uh, bleed them, yep, except, go ahead and install that. So this is supposed to be the app that you use to control, uh, control it from, so it's installing now. I'm going to go ahead and get this all done up and then we'll get back to it. All right, I'm back. We got this all wrapped up. Okay, so I went ahead and ran the wires. I forgot which wire was positive and negative, so I kind of winged it, but luckily I got lucky on the ones I winged. <laughs> so here we are, here it is. Uh, I know right now it's dark, so it's hard to tell, but I'm controlling it right now. So this is pretty cool. I didn't know this, that, this is a color, that teal, number six. Oh, oh snap, what's going on here? Let's see, we change that magenta. <laughs> Heck yeah. Let's put it on strobe. Put it on strobe effect. Oh, this is so cool. Yes. This is the first time I'm walking around to make sure everything is working perfectly. Uh oh. We got a man down. Oh, no we don't. False alarm. Yes. All right, let's go ahead and wrap this video up. Okay, you guys. So I'm back, it's later on at night, same day. Uh, it's about, I don't even know what time it is, one sec. It's about seven o'clock right now. Uh, we, got done with, we got done with the lighting mod earlier. You guys should already know that. Um, but right now, I wanted to wait till it got dark to be able to show you guys how it came out with. Um, I'm extremely, I'm extremely excited. I think it came out really good. Um, mind you, when I show it to you now, there is a light pole, a bright ass LED light pole in my neighborhood, uh, not even 10 feet away from it. So keep in mind, this is not even pitch black, but yet it's still really good. Uh, please let me know how you guys feel about it. Um, I feel really good about it. I think it looks badass and awesome. So I would really appreciate it if you guys can tell me how you feel about it. Um, once again, I'm gonna leave a link for the for the LED light bulbs down below. Uh, I think it came out good. I don't know. I can't stop saying it. So I'm gonna stop blabbing and I'm gonna show y'all the end product. Okay.
hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Um, I think, hey man, I think that came out pretty good. Uh, I'm by no means am I a I'm a rice guy. Like you know, I'm all into the lights and the shows and stuff. But I think that came out good to say the uh, none the least. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it too. If you did, do me a huge favor and leave me that thumbs up uh, and subscribe to the channel. That always helps the channel out a ton. Thank you so much for you guys on Instagram and on YouTube. But really Instagram. Um, you guys are awesome, man. You guys are some cool people, and I, I freaking love it. So thank you so much for uh, supporting the channel, subscribing, liking the videos, watching the videos. I really appreciate it. You guys are badass, man. Um, it, overall, out of 10... I say it's about four, you know, four out of ten in the experience to install it. I mean, you, anybody can really install it. It was only four steps: mount the wires, run the wires, connect it to the box, and run the power and negative to the battery, and you're done. So it was an easy job. Um, I thought it came out real good. I'm actually nice. I'm, I'm, I'm really digging it. Uh, when we throw the lift on it down the road. With the with the rims and stuff and the tires, it's gonna look it's gonna look mean. And I don't know, but uh, these might be going away soon. So uh, if you catch what I'm saying, hint hint. So do do yourself a favor, do me a favor, do everybody a favor. Subscribe to the channel because more content is coming. I guarantee you, I'm not kidding. More content is coming. And then go ahead and hit that thumbs up like button on this video if you enjoyed the content I bring. Uh, by no means is this to hard knock anybody, but be, making these videos and doing, you know, real real YouTubers, it, it, it's hard, man. Especially if you do it for a hobby. Like, it's a, it's a lot of work. Um, it's a lot of work in editing, chopping, you know, getting the video right. So that way the viewer, you guys, can enjoy the content. So when you like the video, one, it helps my videos go get out there so more people can view it. But also, it lets me know that I'm doing, a good, I'm doing the right thing. It lets me know that I'm making the videos the way people want to see them. So by doing that, you really help me out a lot. Uh, either that or commenting. So either way, you know, do what feels right. But I always appreciate it. Um, I'm super grateful for you guys. You guys are awesome. Thank you for watching this video. Once again, uh, that's it. Though, 40 bucks, eBay, uh, Rock Lights, and we're done now. So until next time, you know what I'm saying? Uh, take care. Peace out. And stay true. All right.